okay hey guys so we'll be starting off with our video lecture series on inorganic chemistry so let's get started with our first chapter which is periodic table and periodic properties periodic table and periodic properties first let us see what is a periodic table so periodic table is defined as the arrangement of atoms or elements according to their property in a tabular form so periodic table which is just an arrangement of atoms or elements arrangement of atoms or elements according to their property in tabular fashion or tabular form okay next let us see what what is our lavisher classification so lavisher is a name of a scientist So Lavoisier was the first scientist who classified 10 known elements into two classes which is metals and non-metals so later on this classification but means rather this classification was failed in case of metalloids okay so we discarded this classification so he was the first scientist who classified 10 known elements into metals and non metals and why this this classification failed because of discovery of metalloids so the classification failed in case of metalloids next we would have another classification another scientist who classified the elements his name was dobinier so we would be seeing dobinier classification so he arranged elements in a group of 3 elements having similar properties and found that the atomic mass of the middle element of each triad was almost equal to the atomic mass of first and last element rather was equal to the arithmetic mean of the atomic mass of first and last element of the triad so let's say for example we have this three triad or rather this triad containing li na and potassium so atomic mass is 7 for lithium for uh, rather potassium it's 39 and for sodium it is the arithmetic mean of these two which is 7 plus 39 by 2 comes around 23 and indeed it is 23 so this was the first triad now he also have another triad in which we have calcium strontium and barium so for calcium atomic mass is 40 for barium it is 137 and for strontium it is given that the atomic mass is 88.5 and if we take the arithmetic mean of the first and the last elements in the triad it is 40 plus 137 over 2 which comes around 88.5 okay so he proposed that rather he arranged elements in a group of 3 elements group of 3 elements is called 
triad so this is also called law of triads okay so three elements having similar properties and found that the middle element as the atomic mass of middle element that the atomic mass of the middle element is arithmetic mean of first and third element okay next examples of these can be the triad containing chlorine bromine and iodine chlorine has atomic mass of 35.5 bromine has for 80 atomic mass of 80 and iodine has atomic mass of 127 so if we add chlorine's atomic mass which is 35.5 and add it to iodine's atomic mass divided by 2 so it is nearly equals to means it is 81.25 which is nearly equals to that of bromine's atomic mass which is 80 okay another example was sulfur selenium and tellurium so sulfur has atomic mass of 32 selenium has 79 and and tellurium has atomic mass of 127 so when we again add 32 plus 127 it again gives us the atomic mass nearer to 79.5 which is nearly 79 so all the known elements could not be arranged in the form of triads hence this classification were was discarded so as all the elements could not be classified into a triad hence this classification was discarded okay next another scientist came his name was newland so we will now see newland's classification so this is also called law of octaves okay so he arranged then known elements in an increasing order of their atomic masses and explained that every eighth element is similar in property with the first element just like musical notes of octaves okay so if you look at the elements like hydrogen helium lithium beryllium boron carbon nitrogen oxygen okay so from helium 1 2 3 4 5 6 other first we will be starting from this so first second third fourth five six seventh and eighth eighth is neon okay so he found that the property of earth element from helium was similar to that of neon and they just followed the same pattern after just like the musical notes of octaves which is sa, re, ga 
म प ध नी सो स स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम हिलियम रे टू लिथियम सिमिलरली नाटिल ऑक्सीजन ओके सो दिस वॉज द फर्स्ट सीरीज सेकेंड सीरीज स्टार्टेड फ्रॉम समथिंग लाइक दिस ऑक्सीजन देन फ्लोरिन नियॉन सोडियम मैग्नीशियम एल्यूमिनियम सिलिकन फॉस्फरस सल्फर बट दिस क्लासिफिकेशन वॉज फेल्ड आफ्टर कैल्शियम एंड हेंस इट वॉज रिजेक्टेड दिस क्लासिफिकेशन फेल्ड आफ्टर कैल्शियम एटम and it was rejected or discarded so with this we come to the end of this lecture in the next lecture we'll be seeing some more classification of elements so till then good luck and good bye